Assembly Planner has many modules that allow you to perform and maintain many of your process engineering functions in one central database. Among these modules are the Process FMEA and Control Plan modules. First we'll take a look at authoring FMEAs. You can associate an FMEA to any process in the database, to routings, operations, or activities. This is one key advantage of using Assembly Planner. In one place, you can search for any process and quickly see if there's a completed FMEA link to it, along with all of its details. FMEAs can be viewed and managed in a couple different ways in Assembly Planner. Both use the standard FMEA format. You can use the tree view to build new FMEAs and to visually walk through the analysis. You can use the right-click menu to add new functions, requirements, causes of failure, etc. And when RPN input values are required, the appropriate cell is highlighted and the total values are calculated for you. You can also use the sheet view to either type in or paste new data into the cells. This is what most people are familiar with. Copying and pasting may be especially helpful if you have existing FMEAs that you wish to bring into Assembly Planner. In this case, I have created FMEAs for a few different activities in one routing some of which I performed previously. To see all of the information at once, I can run the FMEA compiled report for the routing. Like other reports in Assembly Planner, this one can be printed, copy and pasted, exported directly to Excel, or saved as a PDF file. In the control plan module, again, you can associate a control plan to any process, routings, operations, or activities. I have just a sample here, but you can edit any way you like in the sheet view. Typing, copying, pasting, deleting rows, adding rows. When you're finished, you can generate a report that can be printed or exported. Process FMEAs and control plans are an important part of maintaining and improving sound processes, and managing them in Assembly Planner's integrated database allows you to stay in the same system where all of your other process engineering is done instead of using a different and separate program altogether.